Big Love is Blind news. We have a date for the reunion. Yes, already. It'll go down March 13th. And we bet a big topic of conversation will be Chelsea's viral Megan Fox moment. Our Denny Directo is with her. And yep, Jimmy too. Do you ever get told you look like a celebrity? Yeah, I do. I do too, all the time. And it's just because I have dark hair and blue eyes. What have you made of the reaction to the Megan Fox comparisons? It was such a silly conversation that Jimmy and yeah. I had. And a lot of the people in the pods were having conversations like this and none of it aired, but mine blew the hell up. It's so silly that now my name is attached to her name. And you know what? It's an accomplishment because let's be real. Huh. <laughs> Just waiting for Megan to respond now. I know, right? I did reach out to her and I was like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I did this to you. No, I don't remember the Megan Fox comments being that big of a deal. I would have done everything to have that moment back. Maybe I wasn't what he was expecting. She definitely lied to me on, on some, uh, how she looks. Do you regret kind of bringing the physical appearance into it? A hundred percent I do regret it. I don't know why. That was a five hour date. It was just a little snippet. And then right before that, he told me he looked like Christian McCaffrey, so. Right, and that didn't air. No. I, I straight up said I'm the Walmart version of Christian McCaffrey. The whole celeb doppelganger debacle is just the beginning for these two. More drama unfolds when new episodes drop next Wednesday on Netflix. Truthfully, you've been a little clingy. Clingy? I felt like Me? I look like a literal psychopath. <laughs> but... Did you have any regrets about that argument? I really don't have any regrets about telling her how I feel. I think some insecurities in King came out of that. You didn't kiss me once today. I did. You never tell me you love me. You Something that didn't air is I asked him why I was being clingy or why he thought I was being clingy. It was because I went grocery shopping and asked him what he wanted for lunch and dinner. And that was just too much for him. And it, what? It, it, <laughs> the whole situation is a lot. Chelsea and Jimmy aren't the only ones making headlines. Jeremy is speaking out after an ex accused him of being engaged when he applied for the show, adding they sold their house just weeks before filming. So I want to quickly address a previous engagement prior to Love is Blind. Um, one, anybody that I was on dates with, my castmates, and in multiple interviews, this topic was discussed. Unfortunately, with all of the footage that is captured, not all of it makes it into the final cut. I did not apply for this while I was living with anybody else. I had already been out on my own for a, a number of weeks at that point.